Hello everyone, welcome back to The Walking Dead, Episode 3, Broken Toys. Previously on The Walking Dead. While searching for a place to call home, AJ and I found an old boarding school run by kids deep in the forest. Their leader was a guy named Marlin. And AJ pulled the trigger. Mm-hmm. I told AJ that what he'd done was murder, that he'd have to atone for it. The other kids agreed. They voted to kick us out. I thought we'd never return. Then, AJ and I were attacked by Abel, one of the raiders Marlin had given the twins to. He was with someone I thought I'd never see again. Lily. We were almost eaten by walkers when suddenly, one of them spoke to me. His name was James, an ex-whisperer who didn't believe in killing walkers. He helped me treat AJ, but without real medicine, he wouldn't make it. The kids didn't turn away the sad sight of AJ and let us back inside. After I told them how we could defend the school against the raiders, they were willing to let us stay, at least until the fight. I decided to help Violet in the bell tower. We looked at the stars together. Violet is a great friend. Those are rare. Then the raiders finally came. They busted open our gates, but the kids stayed hidden as planned. Until Ten ran out of cover, hoping for a chance to learn about his missing sisters. The bomb went off, and attempting to save Ten, Mitch threw himself at Lily and got a knife to the throat. With only a second to decide, I fired and saved Lewis. They got away with three of our friends, and we had no idea where they'd gone. But we knew someone who did. Interrogation time, let's go. Pull the fingernails. Actually, I think. And then cut the fingertips, you know? I think. Pit needles under the no pit needles on the fingertips. Hold them. Cut fingertips. Just to begin the interrogation. <laughs> A lot of bodies. Also I got all the collectibles from last episode. Sometimes, but he was always nice to me. Now he's gone. I want you to go on. Stabbed in the eye by some asshole who never even knew his name. Look, I promise you, Willie, the people who did this were going to hit them back. They're gonna regret ever coming near us. <laughs> if Mitch were here, he wouldn't cry. He'd find a way to get our friends back. Yep. And bash Lily's brains out with a rock. Abel's tied up in the basement. He passed out from the pain. Thanks. AJ wanted to stay down there and keep an eye on him. Just five of us? Hey, buddy. It's time for us to bury Mitch and say our goodbyes. I'll help you. Get bury. away from him! Oh. You're the reason he's dead! Willie! Well, it's true! We had a plan, and that idiot messed it up! Come on, Willie. None of this is Ten's fault. You know who's really to blame. I can't believe you're defending him! This... This is bullshit! Ten! Oh. Let me handle this. Talk to Abel. See if you can't find out where Lily took Vi, Omar, and Asim. I wanted to hurt him, you know, to make him talk, but... I just couldn't. Maybe you'll get more out of him than I did. No problem. <laughs> uh. 
interrogation. All right, but before we interrogate, let's make sure they didn't hide any collectibles, especially now that we can see. Oh, oh. Oh, is that a collectible? Ah, uh, yeah, yep, it is. All right. This should be strong enough to hold him. Okay. Anything else? Make sure I get all the collectibles. We got blood stain. Brody. That rosy. She's my dog now. All right. Uh, <clears throat> before we go over there, make sure we got everything. Can't go up there. <clears throat> got, got something. Got your gun back, huh? Uh huh. Still want dibs? It's different like this, with them all broken. But I still hate them. <sighs> Ready? Um, Junction. His afternoon nap doesn't matter I was having a nice dream too about a girl I used to know from before she also had me tied up but I wasn't her prisoner if you get my meaning <laughs> <laughs> you got any water other than what you already dumped on me I mean drink hmm Got good manners, Squirt. <laughs> You've had your water. Now it's time to talk. It's the first time interrogating someone, isn't it? <laughs> you let me dictate the agenda. Makes me think you're weak. Don't make this harder than it needs to be, okay? I just want to know where Lily took my people. It doesn't matter. As soon as she gets there, she's gonna turn around and come right back for me. <laughs> you better give me the five-star treatment. Mm -hmm. If I'm smiling when she gets here, you might be able to trade me for a little mercy. Okay, yeah. Follow your advice. You aren't gonna do that. You don't have it in you. <laughs> oh. Just tell us where they took our friends so we can get them back. <clears throat> Lily will never give them up. Only reason we came here was for more manpower. Losing Jonathan and me, three sprouts that can barely hold a gun. Even a dummy like me can do the math on that one. We're gonna get him back. You don't know what it's like out there. It's a bloodbath. One community against another, from Richmond to the coast. Oh. Back at the Delta, we're at war with some really sick fucks who make me look like the Virgin Mary. We need people to fight it. Soldiers who do what we say. <laughs> we don't care. No fucking way I'd let my people fight for you. I'm starting to think you're mad at me. You think we like doing raids like this? Our home is under threat. It's a good home, built to last. I'd do a lot to protect it. Maybe you can understand that. And I do a lot to get my friends back. So stop wasting my time. Oh, 
Okay. Front pocket. The answer to all your questions. Read it. Whatsoever parteth the hoof, and is cloven-footed, and cheweth the cud, among the beasts, that shall ye eat? What the fuck? Is this code? No, it's fucking Leviticus. I was hoping it'd be some timely moralistic shit about turning the other cheek. Well, come on. That thing ain't gonna light itself. Wanna know where your friends are? The smoke will clear my mind. Help me remember stuff. Smoke like it. Where Lily went. Burn him. Yep. <laughs> I'm out of patience, Abel. Tell me where Lily went yeah. now. <coughs> oh. That's a lot of blood. Oh fuck. This is not good. Yeah, no kidding. He's gonna die, isn't he? Yeah. Isn't that what you wanted? I did, but... You're gonna get your wish. When you pushed me off that balcony, something must have burst inside of me. Shit. I never wanted things to end like this. Sure enough, Everything. attack this. It all got out of hand. Now look at me. I'm a fucking mess. Will he turn? No. <laughs> my, my whole life. Everything I ever got, I got with my own two hands and my will for my body to turn on me, to take control. I'll tell you where to find Lily. Just promise you won't let me turn. Okay. I'm begging you. How about this? How about you tell me everything you know? And then we'll see. I need assurances. That's as good as you're gonna get. Hurry up, Abel. You don't have much time. You wouldn't do it. You wouldn't let me become one of those things. Try me. <laughs> what if they... What if they could feel it? I don't care. Uh, yep. I really don't care. This isn't about your pain. We want answers. And if you're still in there when you turn, I'll keep asking until you talk. A walker can talk? This one will. Okay. Okay. <coughs> in my boot, you'll find a paper with everything you need to know. AJ, check his boot. We have a boat. <laughs> that paper shows the miles to the nearest stops. Those words, their city names. We use them like a call and response. Make sure we don't go shooting our own. Only one we use these days is Rockingham. I can't believe you actually got me to give that up. <laughs> You, you got what you wanted. Please, don't let me become one of those things. Please, I don't want to turn. Mercy kill. Not that. I want to let me keep my face. You don't need to watch this. I want to.
but At least you can't hurt anyone anymore. Yeah. That's sure you man in front of him. That's did Lee did this simply in front of Clem? Come on, we have a boat to I find. don't think so. No. Once we find the boat, we'll look for a way to sneak on board. Yeah, if Ten doesn't fuck it up this time. Uh -uh. It wasn't Ten's fault. Yes, it was. Mitch died because he... Say one more thing about Ten. I dare you. Guys, there it is. You see anything? The beach, um, a boat, and a, a wood street in the water. That's called a pier. Hmm. Pier. Okay, let's spread out and focus on those areas. Keep your heads low. Okay, spy on the raiders. Oh, oh. Let's make sure we can. What is this? Pick up. I knew it. A rabbit's foot. Omar used to carry around a rabbit's foot. You don't think? We'll take it home. We can give it back to him once we've saved him. Okay, so is that a collect? Oh, it might be a collectible. Okay. Anything over here? Nope. Nope. Okay, space bar to pause. That's nice to know. Got anything over here? No, okay. Let's talk to AJ then. Find anything over here? They have horses. Let me see. Mm. Are those torches? I think so. Could be easy fire. Setting the hay on fire would get their attention. Scare the horses too. We could get on the boat easier that way. Yeah. So the horses are over here. If we cut those horses free, we could slow down anyone trying to chase us. And tell horses. Don't there we go. Luis. Have you ever seen this thing before? No way. Pretty sure I would have remembered an old-timey riverboat. And from where I'm sitting, looks like that pier is the only way inside. Well, let's see what else is down there. Okay, so we got the raiders. There are a few on deck, a couple others on the pier. Could be more inside. Wait, I see Violet. This is really it. We found them. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, come on. The pier has plenty of cover on it. If we're careful, we can sneak in undetected. Uh, okay. I can see an entrance. Yeah. There's one at the other end of the boat, too. There's a small opening at the top of those closed doorways. AJ and I know how to deal with those. Anything else? Oh, up here. I don't see any obvious place to keep prisoners. Don't boats have brigs? Boat jails. Maybe, but where? Now that, I, I, I don't know. Probably at the bottom. 
Uh, anything else? There's no good cover leading up to the boat. We're gonna need one hell of a distraction. Water! Oh. Oh, arrows. Now we just need, what, a dozen walkers? How hard could that be? Maybe not as hard as you'd think. Okay, and now we talk to Willy. Anything useful? Looks like building material. Furniture. Probably stuff from the train station. Sheet metal, wood, and quite a bit of it. We should have that stuff. Okay, fire. More torches. Torches? We could use the fire. Oh, yeah. Mm. They're loading those rafts with supplies. I could cut those loose and just ride them down river. Easy. We should get out of here before they spot us. We can talk through the plan once we're somewhere safe. Scout team intel. Now planning. All right. What's the plan? Wait till night. Well, they've got guards posted on the pier and the boat. There's no way we can take them all at once. Our only hope is to distract them while we sneak on board. We should burn their stuff. That'd work. We could burn the supplies or the hay they keep for the horses. Whatever we don't burn, we should take. Ruby would love to have the horses. Mm, but I'd rather steal the supplies. Yeah, we'll steal their supplies and burn the hay as our distraction. If you're going to steal from the rafts, you have to do it carefully. Wouldn't do it any other way. The fire will lure the raiders away from the boat, and we can sneak across the pier. If anyone sees us, they'll shoot! You remember that guy I told you about? James? He sent in walkers to save us from Lily and Abel. Maybe we could convince him to do it again. If we lead a big enough group of them onto the beach, we can blend in without being seen. Well, hell yeah. Let's find out how much he charges for his services. What about after we get everyone home? I mean, the Raiders will just come attack us again. What then? Hide, quick! Mm. A raider has to be. You all stay here. I'll see if they know anything that could help us. Oh. I don't know how smart that is. Interrogate. Drop it. Uh. Where do you keep the people you steal? I don't know what you're... I'm not fucking around. Answer the question. The boiler deck. Second deck. They're all there. Clem, stop! Oh. Hey, Minnie. Oh. Is this Minnie? After the attack, I wasn't sure. I mean, I heard they burned half your school down. Who survived? Ruby? Mitch? Brody? Ten? Ruby and Ten made it. Mitch didn't. And Brody, um... She died. Ten's boots holding up okay? His boots? They're so old, they're more holes than rubber. I duct taped him up the last time I saw him, but that was a while ago. His boots are fine. Here, Clementine. 
girl who took over after Marlin died. It's weird. I thought everyone would want to lean on their own. Mm. I didn't ask to be put in charge. It just sort of happened. Is that the kind of wishy-washy bullshit you say to everyone back home or just me? Excuse me? Hmm. Abel figured he could talk Marlin into handing everyone over like he and Lily did... Like they did before. You ruined the whole plan. What are you talking about? Marlin traded you and Sophie like it was nothing. Yeah, and we all survived it. Marlin would have never made them fight the way you did. He wouldn't have gotten people killed. That is some grade-A horse shit. Clem saved us. He wouldn't have gotten people killed. He murdered Brody. What? Minerva? Where's Sophie? She... She died protecting the Delta. Hmm. A hero. A hero? God, you... Minerva! Shit. Oh, da, 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 da. Rockingham! Finish up and head back. I want to be in before dark. Yes, ma'am. Our boat leaves for the Delta in two days. Then it'll be a couple of weeks before we can come back for the rest of you. When we do, don't fight. The only way you're gonna save your people is to let us take them. I'm serious. Don't fight this. Mm. The last time your people attacked us, you lost two men. You'll lose more if you come back. Yeah. Are you okay? It doesn't change anything. We still have to get onto that boat. You all should head home. Start getting things ready. Get everyone caught up on the plan. Everyone except ten. I warned you. Enough. Both of you. AJ and I will go find James. Be safe. Let's hope everything goes well. Hopefully Minerva doesn't tell them that we're going to attack them. Even though she doesn't know. So, how many walkers do you think James will help us get? Fifteen? A hundred? A thousand? Clem, I don't... Oh. I Ow. Gunshot wound. It feels like someone pinched me from inside. Here, let's rest a second. Clem, I, I keep thinking. When Willie said all that stuff about Tin before, I got so mad. He was being mean, and Tin wasn't even there to defend himself. I wanted to hurt him. I know I shouldn't, but I just can't stop thinking about it. Uh, I want to just punch his head. I think it don't do it. Breathing, kicking rocks. It's okay to get mad at people. You can't help that. But those thoughts have to stay in your head, okay? Don't act on them, ever. Okay. I'm strong. I can control what I do. But not what I think. Yeah. Like, I think... I think I'm mad at Tin, too. Running out of cover when Lily attacked the school was really stupid. But 
He just doesn't know stuff like we do. And then Willie started yelling at him instead of helping him learn. Why don't the other kids know all the stuff we know? When there's a plan, mm -hmm. you have to follow it. And when you yell at someone, it just makes them not listen. Well, why don't we teach them? They're smart. Someone just has to show them what to do. Yeah. I want Tim to know how to be safe. We can show them how to be smart, like us. It's weird that people are so different. <laughs> it is Erickson's boarding school for troubled youth. Troubled youth? Trouble like bad? So they did bad things? Why? <sighs> okay, um, mm -hmm. sometimes they do them because bad things happen to them. I knew a doctor once, back when you were just a baby. He called it trauma. You have some too, you know. The thing where people can't walk up behind you? I don't like my trauma. I want to get it off of me. How do I get rid of it? I don't even mm. like the way the word sounds. It's really, really hard to do by yourself. A lot of people can't without some help. Like, from a doctor? Sure. Yeah. But those are rare these days. Or, or like the school, right? It was supposed to help with people's trauma. Yeah, yeah. it was. And now they help each other. I still like them. I like Tim the most, I think. Even if he does dumb things. Actually, I think he's my first real friend. Oh, oh yeah? I thought I was your first real friend. Well, yeah, but you don't count. You're old. Oh. Am not. Fine. He's my second first real friend. No. Just second. No first. Okay, got it. W. Oh, is this okay? This is the campground James was at. I don't see James, just monsters. No, <clears throat> oh. James, you're hurt. Oh, what? Uh the raiders do this it looked like they had people from your school why are you here those people you saw we're going to save them but to do that we need your help moving some walkers i could maybe help but my mask is still in the camp inside my bag i can't pass through a herd without it Okay, then let's go get it. Please, I just... I just ask that you don't kill them. The walkers. If you distract them, I can sneak over and find my mask. Distract mm. all of them? Please. I'll... I'll try. Okay, well... Should I... Who uh... sees? Uh, shift to run. Oh god, oh god. Wait, run! Okay, why... Oh god, oh god, oh god. Why am I running? Oh god. So many... Oh god. E. Okay, okay. How much do we have? Okay, this way. We go this way. Oh. I don't know how long I can keep this up. Did you find your mask? I can't find it. The horses must have There. Oh shit. Oh. We have to run. Hey, over here. Uh. Oh, there are too many of them. 
push it, the noise will draw them away. Good idea, good idea. Okay, get ready for two. Two, 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 two. E. Oh. easier to kill them you're kind i appreciate it <laughs> really you bet what we're gonna ask you won't like yep picture Thank of you them for helping me get this back now how will walker save your friends they're being held captive on a boat not too far from here. We can't sneak on board without cover, not without the raiders gunning us down. I see. We want to use walkers to hide, to sneak on board their ship? That's insane. It's our only chance. I have something I need you to see, oh. so you can understand what you're asking. James. We still need his help, right? Yeah, we do. It's safe. Is it? There's a walker right there. Just a little further. Talk to James, but before we talk to James, I'm sure there's a gonna be something hidden, a collectible. Somewhere around here. Uh, what is this? Hmm. Must have had electricity here once. Ah, uh, too bad not anymore. Oh, the toy. <clears throat> Radish. Beat Nick. Ah, uh, beat. Another collectible. Okay. So in here. Let's see. Clem, what's this? It's called a salt lake. Salt lake? Ugh, sounds gross. Whatever you do, don't lick it. It tastes horrible. Wait a minute, how do you know? Did you lick it? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Was that the same answer she gave to Lee when he asked the same question? Was that the reference? If it was, that would... It's a funny reference. Okay. I mean, I think that's all the collectibles. So we go talk to James. Hola, James. My people, my former people, they had a practice. They called it collecting. Hmm. Weird collection. Probably not the weirdest. But so weird. They use them as a weapon. I do this to protect them. 
I know it sounds strange, but that's why I brought you here. To see them as I do. As people. Mm. As people? Well, not people exactly. But... <sighs> something in between. Part of us is still in there. Deep down. Yeah. So few of us die anymore. We turn. Not dead, not alive. God, I hope that's not true. That sounds like hell. To you, maybe. I think it seems... peaceful. Uh, imagine feeling your own skin rotting. Do you really think there's people inside of monsters? Your bones breaking? Somewhere. Yes. Think about it this way. Has someone you cared about turned? What? No. Clem's friend. Lee. She shot him before he did. So he wouldn't have to suffer. Sorry. Maybe this wasn't the best way to explain. Didn't mean to bring up difficult memories. I lived among walkers for years. Still do, in a way. When they're alone, they're harmless. Innocent. If you want my help, I need you to try and walk with them. Oh. Uh. Then tell me if you really believe they're just monsters. They are just monsters. They're not people yeah. or friends. Clem. She'll be safe, I promise. This isn't smart. It's too dangerous. She just mm. needs to move as they do. You know Violet would do it for us. Yeah. She would. I mean, the logic they're harmless when no one's there. I don't think that's a good argument. Because you can say that about like anything. Alone. I'm not leaving you. I'll be right back. Find the exit. I will. Remember to breathe. I will. I promise. The mask will disguise your scent, but be gentle. And be quiet. Touch the wind chime. You'll see. No, oh God. Slow and steady wins the way race. I wonder. Can I? I actually like Oh no. Oh no. Oh. oh 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 Yeah, this is so this is so dangerous. Excuse me, push you push you out of the way. Oh, oh how do I That one's a bit. Push you out of the way. Touch the wind chime. Sweet. Okay, there we go. Touch it. There we go. Nice music. Still didn't change my mind, but... The wind shine.
Oh, hey there, kiddo. Mm -hmm. It's all right. I'm fine. See? S no bites. No bites. Surprised none of them tried so, to leave when the door do opened. Do you still think they're just monsters? Yeah. Now that you've seen them at peace. Yeah, I do. They're still just monsters. Dangerous things that want to kill us. That's what I thought you would say. It's what I would have said too. Once. Mm. Have you ever killed a walker before? I have. Many. Have you ever killed a person? Many. Yeah. But that was a long time ago. I feel like if you survived this I've long... I've killed someone before too. AJ. You've killed someone? Yeah. I'm a murderer. But I'm trying to atone. Well, that's good. I guess. <sighs> that's enough. What about the walkers? Are you going to help us save our friends? I thought I could, but I can't. So many walkers would die. Uh. Oh, the death this would cause. I'm sorry, Clementine, but I can't have more blood on my hands. You saved AJ and me because you said you didn't want us to become soldiers. What makes it okay this time? They're going to make all our friends into killers. More violence, more death. And you could have stopped it. I may be stubborn, but I'm not heartless. So is that a yes? Those raiders are cruel. They force others to be the same. Mm-hmm. And even if your friends think like you, no one deserves that. It'll take some time to guide them through the forest to the shore. Others will join the herd as they go. Tomorrow night, be ready. I can't undo this. Fine by me. Now they leave. Come on, AJ. Let's get back before it's too dark. He's tough. Not like you, though. He doesn't kill monsters, but he's not scared of them either. He's cool. Nick? Hey, Clem. Willie told me the plan. How'd things go with that guy? James. He agreed to help us. If somebody told me we were gonna sneak onto a boat and a herd of walkers, I'd have called them crazy. Mm. What are you doing with those? Oh, well, I wanted to throw one last hoot nanny before the big fight. Swear? Mm -hmm. Huh? It sounds like a swear. No, it's just another word for party. Right. I know it sounds strange, throwing a party, but people need something to lift their spirits right about now. This could be her last chance. Mm. I wanted to make some tea for everyone. Could I borrow your little heater thing? What can I do? We need to pretty up the old music room. Could you make us something colorful to hang up? Okay, I'll be an artist. I'm gonna make the deck, uh, the decor... Decoration? decoration. A decoration for the party. Okay, I'll get the heater. But first, 
let's place all all of our collectibles wherever we can place them nothing here oh can we aim what is this School oh yeah pride go erickson go where no <laughs> like cheering them on okay pick up coffee here no that's not what we need to do and rabbits foot there for luck are bunnies lucky just their feet we could use a little luck i wonder why bunny feet are lucky like how did that happen beat nick what's his name beat nick <laughs> that's funny do you even get what the joke is <laughs> no <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna show him the tin later. How's the drawing coming? Can I see? Nope, it's not done yet, but it is pretty good. Beat Nick is the beat that plays pre six stick beats. Oh god. Messed that one up. Okay, I think that's everything, right? We place down everything. I'm done, Clem. Come see. Okay, be right there. Okay. Let's just make sure we have everything. Wait, anything right here? Nope. Okay. All right. The core. Hey, you're getting better at this. Soon you'll be as good an artist as Ten. I don't know. He's really good. Something wrong? AJ? I was just thinking about stuff while I was drawing. Like what? Ten there people? There are three kind of eyes, Clem. Hmm. Oh, yeah? There are live people eyes. We got those. Mm -hmm. Then there's monsters eyes. They usually look like dirty water. Other times... Monsters' eyes aren't even wet. And then there are live people eyes right as you kill them. Like you did to Abel. His his eyes look like you blew a candle out. He was a bad guy. I know I shouldn't feel like this. I hated him too. I think there's something wrong with me. You know what, AJ? Everything you're feeling is okay. It makes you a good person. Am I good? Yeah. I want to be better, Clem. Let people know I'm good just by my face. You're the best, okay? I'm getting real smart. <laughs> Is that right? Yes, because I'm always thinking all the time. Okay, what are you thinking about right now? Pizza. You getting bit, turning into a no. monster. Oh. Yeah. The older I get, the more I see it. I don't know why. What happens then? No, oh, yeah. Anyone can get bit. Doesn't matter if you're inside or outside or how careful you are. AJ, we've talked about this a lot. If I get bit, you know what has to happen. I don't want to talk about this anymore. But you brought it up, so we're going to. It does something weird to my stomach. Oh, like yeah. I'm gonna get the dookies. AJ, I need to know you remember what we talked about. What you're supposed to do if it happens. Oh no. Listen to me. If I get bit, you'll... Oh, is this a foreshadow? Oh, please don't tell me this is a foreshadow. Shoot. No. No, I'm not gonna do that. AJ, you promised. I don't care. I'm not going to shoot you. If you get bit, I don't want you to bite me too. No. What? You don't mean that. I don't want to be alone. Please don't be mad. I can't live with you not with me, Clem. I know we've talked about it so much, but don't make me. 
Alvin Jr. If you have a gun, you shoot me. If you don't, you use your knife. No knife, a rock to the head, as many times as you have to. I said I don't wanna. I don't care what you said, you will do it. I don't care what you say. God damn it, AJ. <clears throat> You can't break promises, AJ. I know. You're not letting this go, are you? James said... <sighs> Guess not. That we could be around when we're monsters. Like on the inside. If you got bit and then bit me, then maybe we'd still be together. Mm -hmm. It would just be a different together. It's not how it works. We might even be okay. You think so? Let's say James might be right. That monsters have part of the person they were still inside them. The thing is, no one can prove that. And if we can't prove it, we're not going to risk our lives over it. Can I go patrol for a bit? Before the party? Sure, go ahead. Be careful. Hey, little man. Hi, Louis. I'm going on patrol. Hmm. So, patrolling's a thing? Mm-hmm. Patrolling's a thing. Now, yeah, what's, what's this? I was wondering... Well, I can't help but thinking... <sighs> you shot that raider who grabbed me, but... You saw them take Violet, too. Which uh. means... You could have saved Violet and not me. Why? Why would you pick me? I mean, I wouldn't have picked me. Hell, I don't know anyone who would have picked me. Uh. Well, I didn't really have time to think. I just made a split-second decision. It was more of an enemy man. I know I was teasing her, trying to get her to do that one eye roll she does. You know the one, where it's like you're such a dumbass she has to do a full body eye roll. I do it because when I actually do manage to make her laugh, it's worth it. If I needed her, she'd be there, meat cleaver in hand, ready to chop someone in half if it meant protecting me. We're going to get them back, Lewis. Yeah, damn right we will. Hey, Clem. Oh, e. Oh, oh. <laughs> wow, where did you find a beach ball? It was in some garbage behind one of the dorms. I had to blow it up, and that was pretty gross. But look, hmm. it works. <laughs> I should start heading back to the admin building. It's cool, right? Super cool. <laughs> Back. Oh, yeah, I'll fix it. Think fast. Ouch. <laughs> oh, this is nice. I love you, Clem. I love you back, kiddo. <sighs> okay, we better get ready to go. Sounds like they need us in the music room. Okay. Yep. Goodbye, boat. Written and drawn by AJ. Looks like things are coming together. Yeah, we still need to figure out lighting, music, and something to write on that banner. If we're mm. gonna die, we should have some fun first. Music? True. You gonna play the piano all night? Wouldn't be a party without some yeah. kind of mood lighting. I've been going back and forth between colors for ages. Green's calming, but 
Purple might be nice. Rim gets natural moonlight, so something to complement oh, that, maybe. Purple. Hmm. My favorite color. Purple was my dad's favorite color. I read somewhere purple was a color of royalty. And that describes us exactly mm -hmm. not at all. I'll make it happen. Look, check this out. Yeah. When you turn that crank there, are we using the banner for some kind of party theme? Mm, not exactly. It's meant to be more motivational. I'd keep it short, though. Mm. There's not as much room as you think. I was thinking something uplifting, like, we're gonna get through this. Straight and to the point. We're getting them back. Yeah, we sure are. Okay, we'll have Ten break out his paintbrush and ride it out. And now, last but not least, the music. Pulled out the old headmaster's gramophone so he could play some records. Not much of a selection, but it should do. Classical. You guys have any classical? You bet. Ha! Ah, a woman after my own heart. This place is gonna look great. Purple and white classical music playing. Oh, and Willie was asking for you. He's up in Marlin's office. He said he had a surprise for the party, but he wanted to show it to you first. Is it alcohol? Hey, Clem! Check it out! I found a bunch of books on ships! There's some awesome stuff about fires at sea and explosions and stuff! The key is the boiler. Wait, what are you talking about? I have an idea about how to stop those assholes coming back to the school after we've rescued the others. And from hurting anyone else ever again. We're gonna blow up the boat. Oh. It's the only way to make sure they don't come back. Besides, it feels right, you know? For Mitch. Nice. Mitch would love this plan. I know, it's perfect. I can't think of a better memorial than to blow that boat out of the water. The trick Mitch. is timing the explosion so that it happens after you get off the boat. Yeah. Trust me, this will work. We'll be okay. Okay, everybody, get ready to boogie. Best to not die trying to save our people. And, um, Clem, I'm sorry for before about how I treated Ten. I didn't mean to get so angry. Son I know said, it's not his fault. Piggy's dead. That's nice, Ralph. Willie, but don't tell me. Tell Ten. Next. Oh. Got the moves. Great, Ruby. Couldn't have done it without you. But just wait till you see what else I've got planned. Go ahead and mingle. I'll let you know when it's time. I mingle. guess I'll mingle. I see you two are working together. Yeah, Willie asked me to help with his special project. Well, that's good to hear. Is it ready? Good to go, Clem. It'll work. Actually, ah, uh, I was thinking maybe we should name it something cool. I mean, I think it deserves a name. Yeah, we absolutely have to name it. I thought you'd make fun of me, but hell yeah. Let's name this fucker. How about Mitch's masterpiece? Yeah, I like that. Mitch would have too. Okay, then it's settled. I found them. E thirteen F. Okay, Clementine. These here are our official Erickson psych evaluations and probationary reports. Okay. I don't get it. Well, these explain why all of us got sent to this school in the first place. And how we got stuck here for as long as we did. So what's the game? 
I figured if we're all going on this crazy mission together, we might as well know who we really are. So, I'll read some of what the adults thought about us. Oh, no. And you have to guess which one of us fits the bill. I'll make sure it's someone you've actually met. This'll be the first one. While otherwise a remarkable student, blank continues to be plagued by fits of anger, uncontrollable cursing, and repeated physical altercations with the senior faculty. Mm. Well, not to speak ill of the dead, but that sounds exactly like Marlin. Yeah, I guess it does, but no. Wasn't him. Oh. That's Ruby's file! <laughs> Holy shit, really? Guilty as charged. Our oh. sweet Ruby here was kind of a nightmare when she first showed up. Ooh. She once chased the home egg teacher around the yard with a barbecue fork this big. <laughs> no way. <laughs> Don't worry. That was a long time ago. I mean, I can totally see it. The first time I met Ruby, she was all, That little motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I said I was sorry. You guys want to know why I got sent here? Dude. No. Chronic masturbation. Oh. Willie, I speak for all of us when I say nobody has ever, ever wanted to know that. Yeah. What does that mean? <laughs> uh, don't you dare. <laughs> uh, anyway, maybe we should change up the music? Oh, I've all kind of different music, I think. There's country. a lot of them. Sure, we've heard enough of this. Throw some country on. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Yeehaw! I didn't realize how many of us we lost. Mm -hmm. Remember that Justin guy? And Theresa and Jasper, that one girl with colored braces, and Joey, Maddie, Lamar. Aaron. She had the braces. Alex, Dewey, Trey, Stephanie. Oh wow. Holy crap, how many of us died? <sighs> Thirty-four. Damn. Whose is it? Violet's. Oh. Should we read it? I, uh, I, I could tell you guys my story instead. What got me sent here, I mean. Only if you want. It's not great. person you are right now is all that matters to me. Whatever bad things you did in the past, that's not you anymore. Hey, I've got an idea. Do you guys remember when Minnie would sing us Don't Be Afraid when all of us used to get scared? Of course I remember. I helped compose it with her. Could you maybe play it for us if I was here? She could sing the words, but... Yeah. Yeah, I'd love to, Ten. A classical into Don't Be Afraid. This is for you, Minnie. Oh, nice.
Nice and calm, relaxing composure. I wonder how many will die. And how many we can save. Surely not all of them will die, right? That would just suck. Probably like... Lewis or Violet, one of them probably will die. Uh, probably one of the people we don't really see that much will die. Maybe one other. Is this the night? Is. is it it's Lee Oh Hey sweet pea Lee Is this a flashback, a dream? Why the train? Always pick the train. Oh. I'm not sure. Maybe because this is where it all started. Where you taught me to shoot and to cut my hair. To be ready for what was coming. Uh, you were a quick study. Be cool if they did a remaster of The Walking so, Dead. What's on your mind this time? I'm worried, Lee. I've got a lot of people depending on me, and I don't know if what I'm doing is right. Oh, I know that feeling. You know, I was uh, making it all up as I went along, right? Couldn't let on, of course. With you being so little. You kind of had to think on your feet. Monsters took over the world, and you got stuck taking care of an eight-year-old girl. You were a handful, but I didn't get stuck with anything. You kept me going. That's nice. I wonder what this world would be if you Lee was still so alive. I'm with a new group now, and I've been in so many. And they always fall apart. But I really like this one. It's different. People are on your image. feels like home. That's a good thing. It's hard being alone out there. But we're in trouble. Some bad people captured my friends. And getting them back might get the rest of us killed. I'm not worried. What? Whatever trouble you're in, you get out of it. You get your friends out of it. You don't know that. I know you're a survivor. The Clementine I know is gonna fix it. Mm. I really believe that. Yeah, I made it this far, didn't I? You sure did, when a lot of other people couldn't. Never give in, Clem. Imagine how Violet will feel when she finds out you came to rescue her. You'll have given her hope again. I'm fully. Oh, sweet pea, you know you always get like this before something big. Remember how scared you were before you charged into that mess at McCarroll Ranch? You survived that, didn't you? Yeah, what happened? It was different. I was alone. 
I know. It's harder when you have something to lose. But having people you care about, that's a good thing. They're fighting beside you. Because of you. Come see me again. When you've gotten them out, okay? Out and safe. Sound good? And hopefully we can talk about happier things. If you know of any. Lee, I miss you so much. I wish you were really here. I miss you too, Clementine. But we'll have to make do with pretending. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Lee. Talking to you always makes me feel a little bit better. I meant to ask. How's the boy? He's good, Lee. You'd like him. I bet. You teach him to shoot yet? Yep. <laughs> you have no idea. I guess the world got pretty hard since I left it. A kid growing up in it, he'd be hard too. You're in my shoes now, raising a kid. Think you got a handle on it? Uh, it can't be easy. Yeah. Wanted to give him a childhood, but knowing what it takes to survive now. EJ's amazing, Lee. I've taught him to be strong and brave and capable. He'd be so proud. You mean more than I already am? <laughs> yeah. Oh. Why did Lee have to die in season one? Why did Kenny have to die in season three? Wow. Just look at you. <laughs> Just look at you. <laughs> Thought I told you to keep this short. Um, you don't know how hard it is to find scissors these days. <laughs> A knife. Sharp glass. Time to go, Clementine. You've got people that need you. <sighs> Goodbye, Lee. Oh. Clem, wake up. It's time to go. We got a long walk. Time to attack this ship. Arrow to the head. Oh, yeah. Shouldn't I have fired that gun? Uh, I guess we're really doing this. Only the team blending in with the walkers need to cover themselves. Now we just need your walker friend to. He's here. Good lord. Uh, mm -hmm. Hello. Guys, this is James. He's my friend. He's, uh, so cool. <laughs> How do you get the skin like that? Uh, oh, I, um, Clementine? Can I try it on? That's not a good... Well, come on, give him some space. But I just want to... Not right now. Yeah, right. Sorry. I didn't mean to be weird or anything. It's okay. Oh, and... Sorry I tried to shoot you that one time. Your mask looks so real. Because it is Functional real. and fashionable. 
I'll take two. <laughs> Funny. Is this the guy that Clem said she'd... Oh. What? <laughs> yeah. Um, Clementine, could I speak to you alone for a moment? Good idea. Hold tight. Hey, uh, Ten, come here, buddy. I gotta tell you something. Yep. Yeah. The walkers. They'll be here in a little while. You can join them as they pass through the trees. The noise from the boat will draw them toward the water. Then we can get on board and save our friends. Your friends are... different. Open-minded. Accepting. Yep. Yeah. As Maybe everyone should be. You'll be the same. Listen, Clementine. I need to talk to you about AJ. What uh, do you mean? The Whisperers were my family. From a young age. In that time, I witnessed a lot of death and suffering. Eventually, I became the cause of it. Weakness was considered a poison. And I believed in that fiercely. So much so that when another boy expressed sympathy for our enemy before an attack, uh -oh. I slit his throat. I didn't talk to him, didn't consider who he was, what he felt. Honestly, I don't even remember his name. Mm. All I knew was someone like him would only slow us down. That's... that's kind of hard to believe. It doesn't sound anything like you. Not anymore. But it was. I had no doubt in my mind that I was right. After he died, I kept hearing his words in my head. Those people are like us. Just on a different path. I stopped killing after that. I changed. No one else did. When AJ told me he killed someone, it reminded me of them. Of myself. He said it was wrong, but it sounded like he was just repeating what he'd been told. Taking mm. life like that from a young age, it breaks something inside you. I just... I'm afraid if AJ kills again, he won't be able to go back. He won't be the same boy he was. Mm. I've seen it happen too many times. I don't know what to say. Having the life of another in your hands. It's a lot. I'm sure. Just consider it. That's all I ask. They're close. Soon there will be enough of them to provide us cover. I'll lead you through the herd until you reach the boat. That's as far as I go. After that, it's up to you. Thank you. Take care of AJ. And sometimes you have to okay, kill to survive. Kind of hard not Walkers to kill. Close. Especially Rudy, if you're being attacked. You're in charge of the horses. Willie, Dan, take care of the supplies. We're trying to save Dan, someone you I'm care about. The bomb. Find the boiler. There'll be a door on the bottom with ash and stuff. Put it in there. <sighs> See you all on the other side. I'll cut fully it. alive. Lewis told me about Minnie. That Sophie died, and Minnie is one of them now. Just... If you see her out there, tell her... Tell her I forgive her. Please. I tell her myself, but... I just want her to be okay. Yeah, sure. If we see her, I'll let her know. Thanks. And the plot thickens.
It's really happening, isn't it? Yeah, it really is. Other people's lives are depending on us. Depending on me. You're depending on me to... Calm down. What if something happens to you, Clem? What if... What if I can't? I don't know. I can't carry that the rest of my life. I would. I wouldn't have asked you to come with me if I didn't believe in you. Seriously, Louis, I mean it. Just believe me until you believe yourself, okay? All right. Though I don't know if that's as easy as you think it is. Okay, I'll try. But what if I just get us caught too? All it would take is one little screw up, and I'd screw up all the time. Uh, all right, come on, Louis. Get it together. I need you to slap me. Help pull me out of this. Right here. Oh, oh. Louis, you'll be okay. It's ready. Oh. Oh. oh, we're not doing what I think we are. That depends. What do you think we're doing? Oh, God, we are. <laughs> It'll help us blend in with the walkers. Uh. Oh. There. <laughs> I think I'm ready. In the face. Um, no, you're not. Yep, in the face. There. You know, walker blood is one of the hardest stains to get out. You owe me some new clothes. He does do have it? a nice jacket. We're doing it. I wish I had a jacket like that. Okay, follow my lead. Here we go. Oh god. We should get behind them. You. Was that James? Stay behind the walkers. Use them as shields. You? Oh. Well, maybe. You? Okay, behind this one. Okay, we, we just have to go. There's some more, there's some more, there's some more. There was no more walkers. What was I supposed to do? What? Oh, that is James, okay. Stay behind the walkers. Use them as shields. Okay, don't press Q. Okay, Q, 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 Q. Here's one. Okay. Just follow this one. Oh. Likely he didn't see us. We can't risk leaving cover. We'll have to crawl along the side of the dock. 
the Oh yeah, this is gonna be super intense. Oh, that's not good. At least we're on the boat. Oh. Gotta go under. Oh, they're all under? Oh, that's not good. Oh, okay, yep. Okay, Q, 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 Q. Um, E. All right, up. Yeah. You okay? I'm fine. Stay close. Okay. Oh. So much for that. You okay? I'm fine. Okay. Stay close. Stay hidden. And there we go. We stop. We go, we go, we go, we go, we go, we go, we go. Come on, let's hurry. Ready, AJ? Walkers incoming. Uh oh. Oh, uh. Yep, yep. Oh, God. Why are they so fast? Don't know why they were so fast all of a sudden. friends out. Nini said they keep prisoners on the second deck. Look out for guards and stay quiet, okay? Good. I'll scout ahead and signal when it's clear. Got it? Okay, and we scout. Oh, climb stairs? Should we? Is that where we're supposed to? Oh! Okay, maybe climb stairs. I can see the boiler. Okay, climb stairs. Climb stairs. Yeah. Okay, so we can't do that. Can't talk to anyone. Okay. Looks like there's nothing hidden. Yet. Okay. Where we need to plant the bomb. There's too much stuff in the way. 
Maybe there's another way in. Okay. Let's check. Really? No collectibles? Uh... Oh. Okay. Collectibles over here. No? Wait here. Okay. Oh. Uh, grab the bomb. Mitch's masterpiece. masterpiece we all love and support you once they start up this boat we won't have much time before it explodes how long not sure an hour 30 minutes i guess we'd better move i'm our friends but first let's find a collectible i'm sure there's someone one of them around here Focus. Yes, ma'am. Uh oh. I, I have a little brother, short, scarred face. See, he, he's not out there, is he? Look, we've discussed this. Your family is Delta now. There ain't no room for anyone else. Uh, yes, ma'am. Kind of messed up. There's no way we can get in there without her seeing us. Okay. Get out. Not without our people. I swear to God. If you got Ten caught up in this, just just tell me that he's safe. Mm. Give me that. He told me to tell you. He forgives you. you get everyone out then you take my brother and run get him back to where it's safe come on we have to hurry Clementine? holy fuck oh. oh my god are you okay he doesn't look hurt i uh, yeah i'm all right that's We're good right. get violet first she needs to know you're here I'll unlock the other cell. We don't have a lot of time before Dorian comes back. Lewis, give me a hand. Yeah, sure. Okay, there we go. Uh oh. Violet. Oh. What the hell? <sighs> not cool, man, not cool. Vi, what happened? Are you okay? Violet, talk to me. No, We're here on. to take you home. I looked for you. When they grabbed me, I saw you let them take me. 
I'm just supposed to forget that because you're here now? Some fucking friend you are. I'm so sorry, Violet. I didn't have a clear shot. Bullshit. What's wrong uh -oh. with you, Vi? Come on, let's get the hell out of here. No, Clem. I'm done. This whole situation is so fucked. At least here I have Minnie. You mean the Minnie that betrayed us? Don't act like you know her. She tried to escape. Her and Sophie. They said if I fight back, they'd kill Minnie. Or one of you. All you've done is get us hurt or killed. If you fuck this up worse, I'll stop you myself. And don't think I won't. I'm not losing her again or anyone else. We can't give up now. If they take us back to their community, we'll all die. So yeah. what? Your plan is to speed up the process? Whatever you do, leave me out of it. Alright then. I'm going to be a soldier fighting for people you don't know about or care about by force. Okay, it's a collectible in this room. Violet, come on. Fuck off. Mm. Okay. Oh, oh, collectible? Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, thirty, thirty-five, thirty-seven. Looks like there's a gap here. <sighs> Too small to fit my hand through. Hit the door. Clem, are you all right? I'm fine. Where's AJ? Over here. <sighs> Thank God. Is Vi all right? She's saying she won't help us. What the shit? Are you serious? Ugh. We're not moving yet. So at least we've got some time. I guess. Yeah, that's a good thing. Uh, talk to You AJ. doing okay in there, AJ? Yeah, I'm alright. I'm looking for a way out. Yeah, me too. The doors don't look very well made. Maybe that's something we can work with. Uh, okay. Speak to Omar. Omar are you hurt? Let's just get out of here, okay? We will. I found your rabbit's foot back on the beach. Clearly it doesn't work. Hmm. <laughs> uh, you don't know that for sure. How you holding up? Lily. She scares the shit out of me, Clem. Earlier she came down to talk. Fuck. I don't think I've ever been that afraid. <laughs> She's not messing around. We'll be home soon. Just hang in there. Okay, Louis, Louis. Are you alright? <laughs> Me? Yeah, I'm fine. Just trying to figure out the best way to survive an explosion. Hmm? Not being one. Probably the best one. Kick the middle sheet. Uh. Uh, anything else? Wait. No. That's not it. Something I met. Oh, this one. I might be able to chip away at this if I had a tool or. Damn it. They mm. must have taken away my knife. Yeah. AJ, do you still have your knife? Yeah, they didn't find it. Only the big one. Good. Oh, nice. I need you to slide it over to me. Grab a knife, or a shiv. Okay. 
Okay, chip off the rest, see. Keep a lookout. Cute. Hey! Oh! Whatever you doing, don't. I promise you, it ain't worth it. Step back. She awake? Yes, ma'am. Hey. Good. I'll take it from here. Navy jacket. Shit. Where's Abel? Dead. He's dead. We killed him. We put a knife in his head. Fuck. You little monster. Damn it. It was mercy. We showed him mercy. He was terrified of turning. So we stopped him from having to. We gave him what he wanted. <laughs> I'm sure you did. Back up. Minerva. Open the door. Yes, ma'am. Normally, the trouble you caused, I'd shoot you and toss you overboard. Mm -hmm. But I'm genuinely impressed. First, you organize these idiot kids into a fighting force and kill two of my most experienced soldiers. Then you sneak onto my boat under the cover of a herd. I bring a prize like you back to the Delta. It might make this whole clusterfuck of a mission worth it. Someone like you, so young with so much potential, yes, yeah. you're far too valuable to kill. Look, if I'm the one you want, let the others go. This isn't a negotiation. This is me telling you how things are going to be. Oh, all right, then you're done. You know, my father, Larry, was a military man. And when I was a kid, he had all kinds of rules. The thing that bugged him most was waste. If I ever left a light on after leaving a room, he'd flip. No mm. matter how many times he ranted about the cost of electricity, I could never remember to hit that switch. Yep. So? So one day, he let our power get cut. He liked illustrations to show that actions have consequences. No more TV, no more hair dryer, no more ice cream sandwiches. Just a miserable family sitting in the dark. That seems like a pretty stupid way to make a point. It was extreme. But I never left the lights on again. My father had his faults. But he showed me the effectiveness of teaching by example. Oh, is that what this is? A lesson? I want to tell you a story. Let's call it the parable of the twins. Mm. Two girls were taken from their home and brought to a new place to live. They had to leave their friends and family behind and that was hard at first. They shed a lot of tears. But the new place was a good place. The people there grew corn and raised pigs and the twins ate well for the first time in years. They had hot showers, clean clothes, beds. They were given guns and trained to use them. The people there were kind to these girls. All that was asked in return was that they help defend the group. You see, this place had a lot of enemies, killers and thieves who wanted what they had. Kidnapping people and forcing them to fight? Sounds like slavery to me. Call it whatever you want. They were helping each other survive. One of the girls saw that this was a place worth fighting for, and her tears dried. But the other twin, 
she could never forget her old home. She rejected every gift, every opportunity, stirred up trouble every chance she got. She convinced her sister to help her steal a raft and leave on the river. Uh, of course, uh. they didn't get far. What happened then, Minerva? I killed her. Oh, that's fucked Shit, up. Minnie, what the fuck? What? Is that true? Your own sister? Why would you do that? She was twisting my head with her lies. And? I saw I made it. A mistake. I needed to show my loyalty to the place I call home. Like it or not, you're one of my people now, Clem. The question is, which twin are you going to be? The loyal one? Or the dead one? Neither. You, you brainwashed her! You people are fucking sick! Y'all better back away from the door. Uh. I'll be the one who breaks out at night and cuts your throat while you sleep. <sighs> kind of what I expected you to say. But you'll see. I'm not kidding around. I'm not either. Pull the mouthy one out of the cell. Uh oh. This doesn't help your Clearly case. didn't get the moral of the story. We'll have to help them understand. Stop! Don't hurt Lewis, or I'll hurt you. Hey, yo. You better cool it, or you gonna get yourself hurt. Fuck, 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 fuck! Easy. Stay still. No, 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 no. Please, come. Don't make this hurt okay. more than it has to. Yeah. Hey, Jay. Worth it. Son of a bitch. Ooh. Stop. That's enough. He bit me. I said that's enough. You deserve to die. We'll kill you! You think you can kill me? I know I can! We'll throw you in the river! And we'll put a knife right to the side of your head! Big talk for a little guy. <sighs> I know I can do it. I killed Marlin. He wasn't a monster, but you are! <laughs> she... Dang. She's scared. So you killed Marlin. Huh. I bet you'd make a great soldier. Leave him alone. This is between us. Clem seems to care a lot about you. Come on, let's go have a chat. Just us. <laughs> Fucking touch him! Uh -oh. Clem! No, no, please! Clem inside! AJ! Keep an eye on her, Minerva. Lily, don't! Get this thing moving. I want to be far away from here. Fast. I'll start up the boiler. Uh-oh. Don't. Don't you dare look at me like that. This is the only way we survive. Are you serious right now? After everything that she's done, you're just gonna help her? Fuck you! Minerva! Fuck off! What the hell happened to you? You killed Sophie! What the yep. fuck? You just decided, hey, I'll work with these people. They the seem friendly are you enough. Doing? Don't You're have gonna to get understand what happened. Uh, fuck you! <coughs> what the hell are you doing? <coughs> Stop! Shift you. Uh oh. Clem, behind you! Oh, oh. No fucking problem here. Ooh. I won't let you get them all killed. No. Hey, you're the one who's gonna kill them all, not me. Oh. What? E excuse me. Was I not pressing the Q fast enough? Come behind 
you! You're the fucking problem here! Okay, okay. Just pressing Q pre. Okay, press, 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 press. Come on, 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 come on. Stop, Spinerva! I'm warning you! Shoot! What the hell is going on down here? Oh! Oh no no! Wait! That's not what I Dorian! No! Two. Two. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Mm. Violet, we have to go. No! We Fine by me. On the boat. Fuck you, there's a bomb. Mitch is dead. You just, just fucking go. We have to get the hell out of here now. Go. I need to find AJ. I, I, I can. Uh, I'll be fine. Better see you on land. You will. Oh. Shit, they started the boiler. We should be fine. We'll focus that energy. Sharpen it. Damn it. I've known Clementine since before this all started. She'll come around. That's what you think. Wait, can I move? Why can't I move? You'll come around too. Once you see what Wait. we have to offer. Plenty of food, comfortable beds for you and Clem. You can even share a room. Well, why can't I move? Oh. Zoom game. Okay. <sighs> Uh, Trust me, AJ. You're gonna fit right in where I'm from. We respect the strong here, and I can tell by one look at you that you're strong. Both of you are. Hey, why? Is this a glitch? Why can't I move? I'm sorry. Excuse me. Wait, what? Resume. Can I not? I'm pressing W. Why can't I move? What? Is it? Uh. Hey, hey, minion. Are you sure you want to? Return to the menu? No? Saints? What? Can't play it. Controls? Okay. Resume game? Is it something I'm missing? Really? Um, okay, well, I'll try and... Hopefully I don't lose all my progress. Just W wasn't working. Okay, can I resume? Continue episode three. Okay. At least it wasn't that far away. Oh, D, okay. 
I was first indeed though. I've known Clementine since before this all started. She'll come around. You'll come around too, once you see what we have to offer. Plenty of food, comfortable beds for you and Clem. You'll you even share a room, too. once you see what we have to offer. From one more, uh -oh. food, comfortable beds for you and Clem. You... That's ten. Ten! Fuck. Tennessee, did you get lost? Ma'am! He wasn't alone. I got something else to show you. Uh oh. This way. I found this in the herd. Oh. No wonder there were so many walkers. Must have thought you were clever leading those walkers here. Or was that Clementine's idea? Nothing to say. You don't fucking scare me. Oh, James was the cussing. Is that so? Force your ways onto others because you're afraid, because you're weak. Mm -hmm. I give my people a cause to fight for. The thing about people like him, AJ, is that they're too broken to fit into a community. They won't fight for anyone but themselves. <coughs> Kill it. No! Uh oh. Fuck! Easy there, Ten. Don't hurt him. Just. Stop hurting people. Please. Shooter! Why don't we all just take a breath, all right? Give me my friends back. Put down the gun. Let them go. Uh oh. All of Ten us. behind you. Or, or else. Okay. Fine. Go ahead then. Do it. Save your friends. Boom. That's what you came here to do, isn't it? Oh, I see. You came here to cry. Tim. Looks like you're not a soldier either. Oh, Please God. Don't. No! Oh, yeah. Oh. Uh, we're gun, gun, gun. Oh, God. Oh god. E. Shitty. Up. Her oh. Oh. Come on. Come on, kick, 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 kick. Oh. You've made a big fuck. You don't care. Fucking wait. Yep. Yep. Oh, that's a lot of blood. She's definitely dying. AJ, wait! I give up! I will give up! Put down the gun! I'll let everyone leave! My crew and I will leave! That's a lie. That's a fucking lie. AJ! She's not a threat! The gun. You weren't down there. You didn't see what she did. She tried to cut us all up. You don't have to do this, please. It's a trick. It don't is a trick. Fucking dare, AJ. Just give me the gun. You can't let her hurt anyone else. Do it, AJ. There we go. Everyone's from season one's dead. <gasps> Oh 
Oh. Shit, the bomb. AJ! Oh. End of episode three. One left. And with that, I'm going to end the video here. I hope you guys enjoy and hope to see you next one. So, see ya.